They did a software update, they did an unauthorized work, and they bricked his car when the full charge... So I'm seeing more and more of these videos now regarding uh, electric cars being bricked, um, basically unusable um, because of disagreements with the manufacturer or work being carried out on that car that they don't want carried out on that car and they haven't approved. But it's gone ahead anyway. Um, in this instance, they um, upgraded, upgraded the battery, um, which wasn't actually an upgrade. It gave it less miles uh, and ch tried charging the person that owned the car $26,000. $26,000. Anyway, um, he obviously said he, wasn't, he didn't want it done in the first place and uh, contacted Tesla. They said to him, well, if you're not happy with that, then we'll brick the car. And they bricked the car. He, he He's had to sell it because they wouldn't reactivate it for him. Now, what makes this interesting is let's say that Tesla teamed up with your government and said, uh, because they would, let's face it, um, and said, right, anytime this person that owns this car phones in sick for work, we want you to brick their car. If they're not in work, they should be at home. That is something the government would do. And if they're paying Tesla, that's something that Tesla would go along with. These big companies and the government, we all know they're hand in hand. Let's say you're going to the airport, um, but you, they don't want you to re leave the country for some reason. Brick your car. Let's say you're now living in one of these 15 minute um, low emission, um, what do you call it, e economy lockdown areas. And you go to drive to another area lock down your car just that's it you can't go anywhere because your car is just shut down this is incredible to me i never knew about any of this i don't know if this is a new phenomenon um like i said i've only been on the tiktoks and youtubes for um two months so this is just mesmerizing to me my mind is blown right now um but for me electric cars are a hell no absolutely not I will not have something that the government can intervene with in any way. Okay, that's just my opinion. If if the government is connected to it at all, I'm not bothered. I will actively avoid that at all costs. Our government is deceitful. These big companies are deceitful. They will work within their interests, not yours, to do whatever they please. And uh, they're just showing their true colours at the moment with these, at the moment, small stories um, about what's happening. But I'm sure there's going to be a hell of a lot more stories to come.